okay hello guys um this is my second video on this um, channel so i had uploaded a video on um, non destroying type of division using the binary so this time i'll be uploading restoring type most of the users had commented that they want to learn about this and i know it's a long time okay i will get started i'll keep the video quite simple in the previous video i didn't want to you know throw many technical words on you so i use a simple language i didn't uh, specify most significant bit or the least significant bit the quotient reminder the a accumulator and all i didn't want to make the video complicated so this time i'll be telling you all those things um to make sure you understand everything go through the video the link is in the description so let's get start started i'll take the same old example that i used for non restoring type the problem was uh, 12 divided by 3 the question can be asked either this way or it can be asked in binary for 3 it is a uh, 1 and 1 right for 12 it is 4 8 9 10 11 12 right 1 1 double 0 okay for 12 it is 1 1 double 0 the question can be asked either of these ways either 12 divided by 3 or 1 1 0 0 divided by 1 1 <coughs> okay now let's make this simple 12 can be written as 1 1 double 0 okay and 3 can be written as 1 1 to make the to compensate with 12 we need to add two zeros here okay um, to make sure that both of these are four bits okay now <coughs> you'll need minus 3 to calculate in uh, restoring as well as in non restoring whatever the you know divisor is you need the negative of that part so to calculate the negative part of 3 you need to take the two's complement of Three. so taking two's complement is quite easy you just need to take one's complement first one's complement is nothing but inverse of whatever is here zero zero and one and uh, this is one's comp to take two's comp you just need to add one to the one's comp then you have one you know this is what you have as minus three okay now We'll be having two registers here. This will be called as Q. This will be called as A. And uh, whatever steps we'll be doing will be written in this part. So this is um, where you get the quotient. This is where you get the reminder. Now what you need to do is take down the dividend here. So the R dividend is 12, we'll take out 12 here, we need to write 12 here and these are 4 bits right, so you need to take 5 zeros here. Now what you need to do is, this: the steps will be written here, so this is the initial step. Now, to um, we'll call this as cycles. When you keep um, you know calculating, you get some cycles. You have to repeat some particular steps, particular number of times to get the answer. So I'll call this as a cycle. We'll start the first cycle. The first step is to shift A and Q. What you need to do is left shift everything. So zero comes here, the zero comes here, one comes here, one, zero, 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 zero. Same thing. It's just shifting this way towards your left side this will be gone and here there is an empty block we'll call this a empty block <coughs> once it is shifted make sure this is zero if this is zero then you need to subtract you understand right when it is zero you need to subtract and uh, in the previous video I have told what to do when it is one now in 
this concept there is nothing called as subtracting when you need to subtract you don't actually practically subtract it what you do is add the negative of you know your divisor so we are be adding minus 3 here so our minus 3 value is 1 0 1 1 so it's 1 0 1 1 okay now this part is remaining to compensate with this the 4 bits should be made 5 bits so what you do is the most significant digit is 1 so just put a 1 here too okay now once you need to once you subtract this one uh, subtract is nothing but you're adding minus 3 there right so 1 plus 1 is 0 1 carry 1 because 1 plus 0 is 1 0 plus 1 is 1 0 plus 1 is 1 0 plus 1 is again 1 now what you do need to do is if this is a 1 you have to put a 0 in this empty block okay I'll write down the same thing here so you have 0 0 0 1 and this part will be same okay since you have subtracted and you have a 1 here you need to add back 3 what you ha what have you subtracted you have subtracted 3 again you need to add 3 this is why this method is called as restoring because once you have subtracted you're just restoring the same thing again to add 3 you just need to add this part okay 1 1 0 0 this part is empty so to compensate with the 5 bits just need to repeat the same most significant bit that is 0 just repeat it add once you add you have 0 plus 1 is 1 1 plus 1 is 0 1 carry 1 plus 1 is 0 1 carry 1 plus 1 is 0 1 carry same thing okay this is one cycle you have completed one cycle here this is your first cycle okay now you're ready to go with the second cycle this is your initial thing for your second cycle you just need to shift again again you will be shifting again if it's a zero then you need to subtract the same thing repeats again and uh, when it is a one you'll be compensating by adding back that is uh, restoring you'll be restoring but if it's a zero then you shouldn't be doing that I'll tell you in the uh, next steps again into shift we'll be having a you know this will be a zero right so we'll be shifting this here zero zero one one and this will be zero so after you shift everything you have an empty block once more again it's a zero so you'll be subtracting and you'll be subtracting which is not what you're adding minus three here okay that is what subtracting three right again this is nothing but you're adding minus three one plus one is zero one carry one plus one is zero one carry zero one carry zero one carry zero and one carry carries are always neglected in this method zero and you have you have an empty block since after subtracting you have a zero this will be filled with one the opposite always remember the opposite will be filled okay once this is filled since it's a zero you need not add which means you're not restoring okay just remember this part for this particular cycle since it's a zero you're not supposed to add anything you're not restoring anything you are ready to go with for the next cycle this was your second cycle okay again you have to shift once you shift you'll be having one zero zero assuming that you know how to shift I'm not drawing any lines here this will be an empty block here okay I got some work okay I finished it now <coughs> you can uh, go with the third cycle here you have to just shift the same way you did the other two cycles once you shift to the left again since it's zero you need to subtract again you have one 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 zero one since it's a one again you have here 
since it's a 1 this will be filled with the opposite of 1 which is nothing but 0 ok since this is 1 here you need to compensate it by adding 3 which is nothing but restoring now to add you need to add this part One plus one is zero, one carry, zero, one carry, zero, one carry, zero, one carry, zero, one carry. Okay, this we are done with restoring in this cycle. Next, you can go with the fourth cycle, wherein again you need to shift everything to your left, which means this will come here, this will come here, this will come here, the zero will come here, zero, 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 and there is an empty block here. Now again since it's 0, subtract 3, which is nothing but you have to add this part, 1, 0, 1, 1, 1, 0, 1, 0, and an empty block, 1, 0, 1, 1, 1. Since it's a 1, you need to put the opposite of 1, that is nothing but 0. Since it's a 1 again, you need to restore, which is nothing but you have to add back 3. When you're adding back 3, you have to add this part, right? So it is 1, 1, 0, 0, 0. 1 plus 1 is 0, 1 carry, 0, 1 carry, 0, 1 carry, 0, 1 carry, 0, neglect 1 carry. Again, you have here 0, 1, 0, 0. As I said earlier, this is your quotient and this is your reminder to verify with this what uh, you have to do is 12 by 3 right so 12 divided by 3 is nothing but 4 calculate here 2 power 0 2 power 1 2 power 2 and 2 power 3 2 power 2 is nothing but 4 everything else is 0 so the quotient is 4 and the reminder is 0 this is how we do the division by restoring method. Um, hope you like this video. Please do subscribe, share, comment as of what can be done for the next video. Um, thank you guys.